Hey guys, it's Lee, and I'm back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. I was down in Maryland, and I went to, I was down in Towson, Maryland, and I went to the two Joppa Road Dollar Trees and the Taylor Avenue Dollar Tree, and then on my way home, I stopped in Cockeysville at that Dollar Tree. So let me get started and show you what I found. I'm going to start off with what I found at the Cockeysville, Maryland store. And I apologize that you can hear dog eating behind me. Shock of all shocks, plentiful cereal. Still only the cinnamon almond butter. I haven't found the peanut butter one anywhere. I got six of them. They were just putting them out. They had a ton of them. I know it seems like I buy a lot of cereal and I do, but these boxes are not very big and my husband and son can finish one in no time flat. So yeah, as long as I can find them for $1.25, I'm going to keep buying them. A lady who works in the store stopped me and asked me about it um, because she hadn't seen it before. So they were just putting them out and she was super excited and was going to buy some. So if you're in Cockeysville and you want some plentiful cereal, you should probably hurry up. Okay, I also picked up another one of these Razorback tank tops for my daughter. This one's in a medium and it's a really pretty blue. They had a purple one in a small and another color in small. Now I'm sorry if you can hear the cat yelling at me. I did feed her, but you know, she doesn't believe me. <laughs> she just likes to eat. That's everything I got in Cockeysville. I picked up this basket while I was there. I need something to put by the door for the extra dog leashes and harnesses and things. So I got this, it's not exactly what I was looking for. Um, and then I actually ended up finding something better at Ikea. So I'm gonna use that, still not exactly what I wanted, but it's just a solid black laundry hamper. It's plastic. I'm looking for a basket or something, but I don't wanna spend a ton. Of course, when I'm in Maryland, I pick up shelf stable milk. This is the Gossner Foods shelf stable milk and you get one quart of milk and we use this just like regular milk. It is actually now available in Pennsylvania, but I can never find it. But I can usually find it in one of the stores in Maryland. The one beside Guitar Center didn't have it, but the other two did. I got three whole milks. And like I said, we just use this when I run out of milk and I don't want to go to the store just for milk. That's when we use this. I got, I think, three of the 1% as well. Yep, three of those. I don't drink milk by itself. My husband and son do, and they say this tastes just fine. Just stick it in the fridge before you open it, and you'll be good to go. Next, I picked up these jars. You know how I am with jars. But I got these because they have initials on them. So I got L for me. And J, it's for my daughter, but... All three of my kids have J names. We didn't plan to do it that way, but it turned out that way. So it's for my daughter, but if she doesn't want it, I've got two other J names who can use it. And no, I didn't get one for my husband because they didn't have his initial and he wouldn't want it. I'm actually gonna move this now to make more room. And if you hear what sounds like elephants, I don't know if you can hear it, but the chihuahuas are upstairs playing and they're running around, and I tell you they sound like little elephants up there. All right, so next up, I picked up these canvas bags from the Crafter Square Department, and they have, hold on, a zipper and a long strap, and I got these. I am not that crafty, but my daughter's best friend is, and she has a Cricut, and I picked up four of them because I thought maybe she could do something with them. I don't know. Thought they were cute and I'd never seen them before in any of the stores around here. I picked up two packages of felt sheets and they come in a variety of colors. There, I think you can see them. I got that pack, you get eight sheets per pack. And then I got this pack. It has brighter colors in it. This one's more pastel. I don't have a specific use for these just yet. They're good to have on hand and sometimes I need felt and now I don't have to go out and get it. I'll have some. I picked up more of these Sonic the Hedgehog Super Clip Charm Surprise Bags. There's one my son wants. 
and I don't know which one it is. So I grabbed five more. And if he finds it before he opens all of them, he can give the others to his brother. So next up I got some light bulbs. These are warm white, by Sunbeam anyway, they are warm white three-way LED energy saving bulbs. I thought that was a good deal for four bulbs. I mean, I think so anyway, $1.25 I think is a really good deal for four three-way LED bulbs. There are a lot of numbers there and I couldn't save them. So anyway, I grabbed those just to have because you never know. I got two more packs of these Sunbeam LED filament energy saving decor bulbs in soft white. Got two, two packs. I really like these. We have them actually in our porch light and I like them. So I got two more. I probably should have gotten a few more. It's fine. I'm sure I'll find them again. Famous last words. <laughs> I saw someone haul these, and now for the life of me, I can't remember who it was. I don't know. K is for Karen, maybe? Or Sherry over at Twisted Gypsy? I don't know. I saw somebody haul these, and I finally found them. I've been looking for them. These are handheld soap brushes. And yeah, you just put the soap in there, and you can clean pots and pans. I would go stop those chihuahuas, but they're having fun and they rarely ever play. They're old, grumpy girls. Actually, I think my husband's in a meeting. Hang on. All right, he was in a meeting, but I've got it all settled. I put their blankets in the dryer for a few minutes and now they have nice warm blankets to lay on. So anyway, I picked up two of these for my dishes. I also picked up these glue gun pads just to have around. I got the pink one and the blue one. Usually I use a paper plate, but now I have something to actually put it on. I picked up more pill organizers. I haven't bought any for a long time, but I just can't find ones that I like. I'm hoping I like these. I got blue, white, white. <laughs> and green. I take vitamins and sometimes I can't remember if I've taken them or not so I think it would be great to put them in something but so far the ones I've gotten haven't really worked out for me. I just didn't like them so I'm gonna open one of these real quick. I'm gonna open the blue one because that's the one I would probably use. So you press the button and it changes to the next compartment. Very cool. And then you just open that up. Now, how do you fill it? Is that how you fill it? All right, that does come off to make it easier to fill. I was afraid I was gonna break it. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully I'll like this one. All right, so I got, I got some antibacterial hand wipes just to keep in my car. I just like to have them. Um, so I got some, I forgot to show you, it comes in two different packets and that there are 30 wipes total, so 15 in each package. I found these two lip balms. These rang up for a dollar, not a dollar 25. So I got Peanuts, which is candy cane flavored, and Frosty the Snowman, which is frosted berry scented. They had a SpongeBob and I think an Elf on the Shelf as well. Those were both mint of some sort um but yeah i just got two of them those are really cute i also found the disney flavored lip balms this one's mint hot chocolate and this one is candy cane swirl i'm gonna open one of these because i kind of want to see what they're like they're super cute with the little pom-poms on top so i'm happy about the fact that this is the kind that you turn you know, to make it go up instead of the kind to stick your finger in. I hate that kind. Anyway, I got two of each of those to share. I picked up these kitchen shears, even though I don't really need them. I just like the color and they are very cheaply made. They feel really cheaply made, but I can use them for opening packages and you know, whatever. I just thought they were pretty. They came in other colors, which I do have pictures of. I forgot to mention that, that once I show you everything I bought, I will have pictures at the end of the items I saw but didn't want or need, but I thought you might like to see. 
So hang around and check those out. So next I picked up one of these hooks in blue. I'm thinking I'm gonna hang it over by the door so we have something pretty to hang leashes on. Right now they're just kinda on the floor as you walk through the door. They have a place, but it's not close enough to the door and they end up just getting dropped. So I was gonna put this near the door. I got these shot glasses because they're so cute and they're by Crystar or Crystar. I don't know how you say it. They're made in Colombia. This one just says ho, ho, ho. This one says elf sized. And this one says jingle juice. And I'm just gonna add these to the collection of shot glasses we have downstairs. You know, for that party I keep saying we might have that we never have. You know, but we might, we might. Probably we're not, but they're really cute, so I bought them. Would it even be a Lee's home haul if I didn't get some socks? These are the Aromatherapy Aloe Socks. It says infused with natural aloe vera and vitamin E, and they are aromatic. Um, I mean, they don't smell like anything. Doesn't aromatic mean they should smell like something? They don't smell like anything, but they're really cute. So I got this pair that is a cat. I got this pair that is an owl. That's what I'm going with. And I got the pink ones that are unicorn faces. So cute. I mean, even if they don't work as aloe socks, you know, they're cute and they'll be warm. So that's the important part. Then the last two items I got were really, really cool. And this one I'm about to show you, I think I got it on Taylor Avenue. It might have been the Joppa Road one that's not next to Guitar Center. I don't know the area that well. So this is by Saker. It's a picture hanging and leveling tool. So it says it's easy to use, multifunction, hanging accurately. I'm holding it like this because of the glare. Um, this is how it says to use it. Perfect. I don't know. We're gonna try it out at some point. But I picked up a few of them because if it works, then I'm gonna give them to my friends, of course. <laughs> you know, I mean, let's make everybody's life easier for $1.25. So I'm super happy about that. I'm trying to find a place I can put them so you can still see them. And then the very last item I got is so cool. And I got it at the Joppa Road one by Guitar Center. I picked up the Vasta Sheet Slicer. Just spin and slice your favorite vegetables and fruits. Ideal for low carb cooking, razor sharp stainless steel blades. Um, it has a fettuccine blade. So this is what it looks like. And unfortunately, I don't have anything to test it with. I would totally test this out. So you can make like fettuccine sized. I thought it was really kind of cool. So I got one to try out. If you have this and you've tried it, let me know what you think of it. All right, so that's everything I picked up at four stores in Maryland. Now I have pictures of items to show you that, like I said before, I didn't need them or want them, but I really thought you might like to see them. So check those out and meet me right back here.
Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.